long back to no one plays EU4 here as Brandenburg. We are currently in a, a very terrible war versus the Teutons. Um, yeah, I thought we could do it easily. But apparently Poland and Lithuania are way behind in tech. I wish I could check how many points they have. That would be great. To see if we actually have a chance of accumulating them over the course of the next couple of days or not. Or maybe we can also just get them to waste a couple of guys on a tr due to attrition. Get some of that little guys out of here. Get out of here, Verdon. They're not even here with their force. Damn it. Hmm. The war enthusiasm is still high. And I've even out the numbers already. That 14,000 advantage we had, gone. No? Okay, good. If we can just do a little pressure against Bohemia, it'd be great. Three days. Marissa is not actually great to defend in either. Um, 23rd, 26th. Okay, we're gonna get away here. I think we should try to engage the Mecklenburgian troops. Which, without any grace, have defiled my alliance. Offered him peace and prosperity, and they spat on it. Also, we are rolling amazingly well. I mean, what the fuck, game? We have more troops, we're flanking them, and they're all, like, squared up. They should be fine. We have a massive advantage over them. Of a four, sh four fire and two shock. To be fair, the two shock advantage isn't that great. Or isn't that's pretty good. It's pretty damn good. Two shocks would actually make a massive difference. Must run. No, oh, why are you all coming after me? Oh, shit. Do want to reinforce here. This is in the woods. But if they're all going over there, then reinforcing here won't do much. We're going to come. What? The fuck are they going? Why the fuck are they going there? Oh shit. They were following me. No. If only I got in there earlier. But now they're being led by an idiot. Because I did take the negative one, but I mean, come on. We have the advantage to our general. We have a better general. We have a negative one, yes, but we have a better general in both, so. There should be no reason for losing. God damn it, there's no reason why we should be losing except that they have very good rules. Seriously, not a singular reason. We have more troops in here. We have the better general. Just give. Throw me a bone game. We have a plus one, plus one to every single roll, so their rolls were certainly better than a plus one, plus one more on average in this entire battle. 
because they also had a tactic disadvantage of 0.7. No, 0.7.2. Still, they freaking won a battle with a tactics disadvantage with a general disadvantage and a slight terrain advantage that was actually um, outweighed by the general disadvantage. They still won. They also were outnumbered. Still won. Those fuckers. At an end. against me with equal maneuver. able to hold on this spell long enough. 16th. Good general, though. There's still a slight disadvantage, but now they have the numbers on their side. Fuck. Oh, come on, did they really destroy the entire Polish army essentially? Yup, yup, yup. Fucking hell. Fucking hell, Poland! What the hell is wrong with you? Why can't your people fight? Fight? I guess they do have a dis... Well, no. They do have a discipline advantage, but it shouldn't matter that much in the beginning, right? Right? Who knows anymore what is reality and what is just a fantasy? Does not seem that great anymore. I need more. I need more. More points.
Okay, no men. Okay, we can just do this now. Since we literally don't have any additional men. Might as well square up. There's nobody of them that wants out, right? Can I make convince Bohemia? Seventeen. Ouch. That bone enthusiasm, not good. Not good at all. white piece something <laughs> still not enough though Defense. But it will be futile, no. Got a shatter up there. There may still be a slight chance. A very, very slight chance. I mean, it's pretty damn unlikely. Who knows? Power anyway, so I don't care. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try to siege down some more of their land. God damn it, Lithuania! God damn it, you're being useless. At least I siege down one province, I guess. My non up war score, they do increase. More exhaustion as well as give reasons for peace. Of course, the problem is Poland should have come up here like a long time ago. Damn it, I shouldn't have fought their army straight up. But I thought that my armies were strong. I thought I could do it. I need to move. Ninth, tenth. Okay, good. Okay, 
Let this war turn around now, please. Only I can get Poland to stay in. A couple of victories could do it, potentially. Chased him around. We can do it. We can do it. Tom is already military tech five. The Ottomans, for example, steaming ahead, thinking of oh how superior they are. I will show them superiority. Yeah, we turned around the war in terms of troops, but we're still teetering on the edge with Polish approval of the war. <laughs> no, that was a way too hard, hard fought war, isolating the enemy. It was also costly because we cannot take anything from Bohemia right now. On the other hand, we might be able to do it in a future war. Not too far away from now. Can I get Austrian help on that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Can get Austrian help against Bohemia. That is good news. Just like that, the tide of the war has turned. Still negative 12 from battles. But it's looking good. Mon's approval is not majestically high. But it's there. Good. Good. Their enthusiasm is dropping. We are sieging. We are finally sieging them. <laughs> it took so long. It took so long. What a terrible, terrible war. More exhaustion of military strength is mainly contributing to the negative factors, but making gains, right? Length of war is actually still positive. That's kind of a surprise. It's only three years. It's only been three years. Still need to get a lot more war score, though. Before we can even anything out of it. Well, 
Poland seems to be able to hold its own now. And oh my god, it's already time to cut this episode. Uh, we'll go until the... Well, never mind, we don't go until the war ends. Because the war is still going to take like maybe five or six more minutes. Before we do any real sieges here. We still are on precarious ground, hoping that Poland will not peace out. Uh, yeah. Well, let's just hope. Well, come on, we are winning now. We are winning high. You can't, you can't be so now. Anyways, I hope you guys join me next time to see if we actually get back into the positive. If Poland will just be a traitor and peace out. And if... Or who we're going to attack next. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and have a good day.